I have to say that it happened in Squim when I barely knew Neil and he told me that I touched his weenus. That wasn't this year, was it? And I actually thought he said the P word. <laughs> What's the P word? P <laughs> But he did say weenus. Do you, what is the weenus? A weenus is uh, your elbow. Oh. We each have two, well, most of us. <laughs> Hey, Neil. That's me. Uh, <laughs> guess, Joss. What is your favorite memory of 2017? My favorite memory would be uh, when Kim uh, very vigorously uh, attacked my weenus. Um, <laughs> uh, she, she bumped into me and uh, it started this whole crazy thing and it was wonderful and I loved every minute of her touching the your weenus. weenus. Well, you know, I mean, among us, yes, yeah. yeah that, uh, but I just love all the, the fun it's brought and all the laughs. So that's my favorite. Right here, right now. Paula and Barbara here from the Jersey Shore. Uh, favorite memory is we met on our first day at the Jersey Shore because she had a PVD. <laughs> Sounds like something you get from a nightclub, okay? Let's cut, let's edit that out. Um, favorite memory of 2017, one of our patients came in wearing a pink tutu and sang happy birthday to me. No, that and that was last whole... year. When I turned 29. That was... How old am I? 30. I'm 30. Okay. Oh, I had a baby and got married. That's my favorite memory. <laughs> I forgot. What year that accent that? changed real quick. I know. I can't even like, That's how I felt. Oh, my favorite memory, pirates at the retina center. <laughs> Arr! Arr! <laughs> Top of the morning to ya. Me and Dr. O'Malley bonded over our favorite kinds of butter. Kelly Gold, it's the best. <laughs> you should totally do My favorite memory of 2017 is when I came back from maternity leave to a beautiful new building in Squim. So, my favorite moment at or moments of, of 2017 at Retina Center were most likely involving the office, our new office in Squim. Uh, more specifically, playing on the construction equipment and swinging from the rafters. <laughs> so, is this better, or is this better? No different. Is that better? Is that <laughs> no change? <laughs> My favorite memory was when I got to test Melissa's eyes at Retina Center Northwest. My favorite memory has to be October 31st, National Knock Knock Joke Day in Swim with Todd. That whole day he just went back and forth between exam rooms and telling us a knock knock joke every single time. Um, that probably has to be the most entertaining day we've had um, in a little while up there. It was pretty good. <laughs> favorite retina center memory. There's so many, but I have decided after much deliberation that <laughs> I love sitting next to Melissa during morning meetings because usually somebody says something that we think is hilarious and we happen to look at each other at the same time. And even if nobody else is laughing, we know like the other person's going to be laughing. And <laughs> so we've like looked at each other and then just died laughing. And so I love that. <laughs> it, it usually has something to do with Kim. Kim always says, some good gems. She does. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'd, I'd go with that. So favorite memory um, for Retina Center this year? Uh, I guess a couple of things. One is all the fantastic new staff that have joined us this year. They've all been great. Um, moving to the new Squim building, it's really been awesome. Really enjoying it there. Um, and Star Little came back. Those are my favorite memories. <laughs> So I'm supposed to give you guys my most memorable moment at RCNW this year. Mia, can you, can you? Yes, I agree with Mia. There is no memorable moment. This has been a great year for me. I can't say enough about the staff I work for and the docs I work for. My favorite memory 
would have to be when we were working in SQUIM and Jelaine thought there was no more patience in the clinic and she was singing and dancing out towards the lobby and found there was still a patient there so she danced her way back out and asked us why we didn't tell her that there was somebody still waiting. That would be my most memorable. So not necessarily my favorite RCNW memory of this year but just recently a patient tried to kiss me so that was a little bit weird. Um, she like went in for it and I was just like what are we doing? I don't think she was going in for a kiss but I felt that way. But anyway there's too many memories. <laughs> memory is from a swim day, I was sitting at the front desk just on the computer prepping charts and Karen walked past me real quick and it just kind of like a waft of like a poop smell kind of came about and I just thought to myself, did she just crop dust me? But I was like, whatever, it happens. So I just kept typing and then she comes back and she grabs the trash can and she was like, a patient threw their poopy diaper in the trash can. And I looked at her and I was like, oh, okay, I thought you farted and then just walked away. <laughs> might sound a little dorky, I know that I've spent a lot of time on the, the SQUIM building, but one of my favorite moments was as it was um, kind of all covered in and the walls were starting to come together and uh, Todd and I, we did a walk through and it was one of those moments where I think, I think I verbally said, holy cow, I'm starting to dork out about this. You know, just everything was really starting to come together and the lines on the, the paper was really uh, starting to materialize and that, that, that was just a really neat thing because we've been working towards that for a long time. So, Hi everybody! Uh, I know this was supposed to be a favorite memory. Don't have one. Every day is exciting and new and I'm blessed to have all of you in my life. One of my favorite things from 2017, besides all the pranks that we play, um, is just working together with such amazing people. You guys make work enjoyable. Recent favorite memories at Retina Center, because there's a lot to choose from, um, was a few weeks ago when we were up in Squim on a Tuesday, and it was National Knock Knock Joke Day, and there were quite a few knock knock jokes flying around. It was pretty fun. I'd have to say my favorite memory working at the office happened two months after I started working there. I had graduated from college and the, the Monday following the commencement ceremony, the girls at the front desk had a gift waiting for me um, when I got in um, just to say congratulations and I thought that was just, it, it blew me away and that was the first time I really felt like I was officially part of the crazy Cretna family and it's always stood out to me as such a great like welcoming moment and um, reassured me about what a work family is and what it should be. Is this on? Hello? Oh, it's on, okay. Um, hi, I have been asked to share with you uh, my greatest memories uh, for 2017 on Retina Center Northwest. And I think uh, I have many great memories. I, I pretty much have a great memory every day uh, when I get to work and I see a bunch of smiley, enthusiastic faces who are there to take care of each other and uh, myself and Adrian and David and our patients. Uh, and I also have a lot of fond memories uh, of interacting with our patients. But probably my fondest memory is that we finally have achieved uh, opening up a new office in SQUIM where we spend a fair amount of our time, uh, which previously uh, was really kind of the forgotten stepchild. Uh, I was a little surprised that the staff's uh, greatest uh, uh, desire uh, was for more bathrooms and uh, a little concerned that there were several questions by those that will not be named about the Wi-Fi connectability from the bathroom. So that's something we'll have to keep a watch on. But other than that, I think the greatest thing about 2017 overall was that we opened up a beautiful office in Squim. Uh, and I want to thank everyone who helped make that possible. Happy New Year. Okay, so since we're having the opportunity to tell, to tell you guys how much we love you, um, I feel so grateful that this has been my longest relationship and I continue, I want to continue to be here until I'm like 80. So um, every day is great that I can come here and it feel like family and all of the new people and all of the older people that have been here that have, oh my gosh you guys, I just love everybody. Oh. And 
Every day is great. Thank you. Thank you for taking a chance on me, a girl that worked for the county for 17 years with potholes and asphalt. I have to say that very carefully. <laughs> so <laughs> I appreciate you taking a chance on me because I love it here and I hope to be here for many years and, you, and we really are a family and that really is very special. So thank you. I just want to say thank you to everyone here. Um, it's just been amazing to come to work every day and have such a great support system from you guys. Um, the last few months have been really hard for me and I didn't think that I was going to get through it, but just coming here every day and seeing you guys and just knowing that you genuinely care about me um, just means so much. And I just want to say thank you if you laughed with me or cried with me or just listened to me rant and vent because I know I can be super annoying about <laughs> sometimes but I just appreciate you guys all so much and um, just everything that you've done for me and making sure that I'm okay and I'm so glad to work here and I can't wait for next year. Even though I hate waking up early and the van sometimes makes me nauseous, I still enjoy coming to work every single day and it's because of our doctors and how they treat us and how they treat our patients. So thank you guys for making this a place that we can't wait to come to work to and see what kind of shenanigans will happen in the office next. I just want to say thank you to everybody actually. Um, I've learned a lot and I hope to just keep learning more. Well, what am I thankful for? The whole retinal family. I love working here. I get up every morning in beautiful squib and I just have such a grateful heart for the job. Um, the doctors are amazing and I've worked for many and they truly are amazing. The staff, you can't, it cannot be beat. So thank you everybody. I am so glad to work at Retina Center. I, I was talking to somebody about this the other day, but not all doctors are as generous and kind and just fun like human beings like that we have here. And so I'm really grateful to work with all of you and Robert too. Um, it's just really nice to come to work each day and to be around everybody. And um, so I'm just, I'm really grateful for that. And um, we definitely, you guys are some decent human beings. I am. I'm, <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm not really prepared for this because my speech writer's on vacation this week. So I just want to say thank you to all of the doctors and all of the staff that has put up with me for the last 12 years. I don't know how the heck you did it. I appreciate y'all and thanks for everything. Happy holidays. And I'm also thankful for my working family who has been so diligent, so hardworking this year at making making our dreams of building the building a reality while still providing phenomenal patient care and helping take care of not only the patients that we love, um, but taking care of our doctors uh, and also taking care of each other. We've really had an amazing year where everybody's really pulled together and helped each other on a professional level as well as a personal level. So that's what I'm thinking. I am thankful for the amazing environment they have created for us. Um, I just want to thank the docs and Robert uh, for everything that they do and making us feel special and like we really are like a family here. Um, there's not a day that I don't go home and I feel like I'm appreciated and I'm really proud of working here at Retina Center Northwest and just a big thank you. I've been in this field since 1985. And the docs are the best docs I've ever, ever have worked for. So I just want to say thank you guys and happy holidays and a happy new year. I can't wait for 2018. What I'm thankful for is waking up every morning, going into the office and seeing bright smiling faces and um, working with three amazing doctors that not only look after their patients but definitely look after us so I'm very thankful for for those three and the amazing staff that actually accept my weirdness and all my crazy accents and um, I love you guys and thank you for being my work family thank you to each and every one of you for all your love and support to Todd Adrian and David you guys are amazing and it's an honor to work for you. Have a great holiday. And I just want to say thank you so much for the best place to work ever.
I'm thankful for uh, the way they make everybody feel. They make us feel like family, um, which was one of the reasons I decided to stay rather than leave. They're very family oriented. Stop rolling your eyes at me. <laughs> very family oriented and they just make everybody feel nice and warm. So thank you very much for that. I just wanna thank you doctors for creating an environment that facilitates family so well. It's awesome to come to work every day and um, know that I'm so close to my coworkers and my bosses. So thank you for that. And to Todd, David, and Adrian, from the bottom of my heart, thank you. I enjoy working with you guys immensely and without you, we wouldn't be here. We wanted to thank you for another great year. Remember to <laughs> make good choices. appreciate you so much. Remember who you are. We love you! Thank you! <laughs>I just want to say thank you as well. 2017 has been a crazy year for a lot of the staff with so many ups and downs and some have had some drastic life changes. But if anything has been constant in our lives, it's been Retina Center, which wouldn't exist without our three amazing doctors, Todd, David, and Adrian. Thank you for creating a home away from home for us. You go above and beyond for each and every one of us. And I think I speak for everyone when I say we love you with all our hearts. So thank you for everything. Um, I'd also like to thank everyone who contributed to this video. It was pretty last minute. And by last minute, I mean yesterday. Um, but everyone pulled through to make this happen. So thank you. And thank you to Retina Center to allow us the freedom and creativity to do things like this. Um, so last year we had a blooper reel for the video and everyone seemed to enjoy it so much so we had to do it again. So get prepared for some weird stuff and enjoy. And action. <laughs> Just a minute. Oh wait, wait, this one's my grocery list. Can cat food. Wait, what am I doing? So you're just gonna say like a thank you, like oh you can Another favorite from 2017 is getting to know my coworkers better, like Neil and his many nicknames. Neil the Real Deal, Umbrella Neil, Nilium, Anelia. Ready? Okay. So, thinking about my favorite memory for 2017, I think of things outside of Retina Center, because Retina Center is just my, my home away from home. So, I don't really have a lot of memories because every day is pretty fun. Um, knock knock joke that's my favorite obviously I like poop jokes so I just ruined it I totally ruined it yeah. oh wait no, I'm a double photographer <laughs> wait no, no Joss needs to do it so she can turn around <laughs> I'm just thinking of a good memory oh. she's They're pondering right now. <laughs> she's like I'm a happy girl are you ready? I'm ready okay go my favorite memory is, okay, fuck, let me start over. Okay, it has to be good. What's your favorite memory? My favorite memory, or one of my favorite memories, happens to be when, why can't I do this? <laughs> okay, my favorite memory is one from Squim. Um, I was sitting up at the front, or at the desk, <laughs> no, this is fine. No, this is okay. Knock, knock. Who's there? Europe. Europe who? No, Europe who? Are you filming right? Cross your heart and hope to die. Thanks for sticking needles in people's eyes so they can see well to compliment us. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't. <laughs> Cassie is not expecting that from you at all. I can't do this. this. You need to get done. Is this thing on? Okay. Well, hello everybody. My name's Paula. I don't know if you've heard about me, but I'm Barbara's best friend and I'm from Jersey. And uh, I'm in town for the Retina Center party. Just getting ready. Doing my makeup. You know. 
trying to look good like all you folks in the audience right there. Mm -hmm. All right. So, as you may or may not know, me and Barbara met at the Jersey Shore a couple years ago where she got a little case of the PVD, but don't worry, it's curable. It sounds worse than it really is. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Now, all right. I see all those YouTube videos with the, that contour. So good, but so still working on it. I'm a work in progress, you know? Okay. All right, so, uh, let me go find my lipstick, just a second. Oh, hey there. Okay. So, uh, the thing about makeup is just, you can really just be who you want to be when you wear it, you know? I love Lauren and those, those videos she does with her unique makeup. She looks so good. She's just so good, so talented, and her skin so smooth, you know? Lauren, you look good tonight too, honey. Mm-hmm. So, uh, let's see here. Just gotta finish it up, you know? Get really glossy for the, for the fellas, you know? I'm only in town for a couple of days. Alrighty, well, you know, let me show you, let me show you my shirt here. All right, guys, well, last video here, we got our makeup done, we got my festive sweater on can't wait to catch up with the gals at the retina center party oh oh alrighty well I think the cabs are here see you later There's all kinds of grease up here. I don't think I'm going up any higher. <laughs> all right, anything else? Because I gotta go get the beer and wine. No, nope. so. oh, go, go, go. All right. Go.